got me at the Cheesecake Factory, y'all. I ain't getting out this car. I feel like I'm doing everything I'm supposed to do as a woman. But I, I got mean, myself all made nothing up. nothing wrong with the Cheesecake Factory, right? Yes, there's a lot wrong with the Cheesecake Factory. That means wherever I want to go, take me. Absolutely. Whatever I want, you buy me. Last time you took that, took her out on that Cheesecake Factory thing, man, you were a lot of things that you actually did wrong, too. Because they look pretty, because they look cute, does not mean that they're innocent. You always got to fit. You always got to measure. Hey, what's up, Moe? It's Kev. Here to see Dwight. Yo, yo! Yo! So, last night you was talking to me about the Cheesecake Factory. You met Moe, right? Yeah, what's up, Moe? What's up? Thank good with you. Mm -hmm. Good. So you were telling me last night that you liked the, the interview. Yeah, yeah. So dude asked me to, uh, to counsel him to be his coach. Oh, for real? Yeah, bro. You know the Cheesecake Factory girl? <laughs> yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to counsel the dude. We're going to get him up and ready so they can start oh, playing him. Lord. I got a couple dates set up for him, right? Oh, man. So I got a date set up for him tonight. But tonight? I'm going to invade the whole date, though. But I, I can't do it without you. So look, I'm going to tell you, it's the big part, right? All right? So I had to come talk to you in person about this. What you need me to do? I just need you to walk in. Oh, Lord. Look, you already known, right? You tall. She said she like tall guys. But she, listen, she's saying she want to she wanna talk to him, to Jay. So she's so, going to be on a date like she wants to talk to Jay. Uh -huh. And I just want to test her. So okay. she's saying she's so interested in this nice guy online. You know, he's, he seems like a nice guy. Okay. That's tough, man. You know, I don't want to be the bad guy and then, you know, It'd be hard to trust these. It'd be hard to trust a lot of people out here. Because there's a lot of women going to be coming at him? Yes, now. yes. Because he's known, and they're not really going to be genuinely interested, right? Yeah, yeah so, he's going to need somebody to talk to. Right. So, so you want me to do it? Because think about this. You playing the bad guy, I guess. But what you're doing for him, ultimately, is going to be much greater than that. So he telling me how excited he is. I'm still telling him, when you get successful, that's when you got to look for him to play you. So they gonna come in droves, but you don't know who really wants you. Right, but I don't want to be the one they blame. You know they done blame me for a lot. Nah, you don't want to show him something. This right here, show him, show him a big lesson. You don't want him getting out here and put, investing time and energy into somebody, and all of a sudden she see the guy she like, and now she running off leaving. But we see this all the time. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to teach him that lesson. You don't want to go for the person that likes you. Right. You know what I'm saying? And we're not gonna pressure. Yeah. You just walk in and you just see what she does. If she don't bite, hey, but she'll see you walk in and we'll, we'll just see. You just look in the direction. See, my goal is that he find the, he find the find woman for, for him. him. Yeah. So he sit with this girl. That's tough, man. When you walk in, that's gonna be a good test so we can see if she's really there for him. All I want you to do, walk in, sit down, uh -huh. look in her area, you know? Let's see what she do. You know, yeah. All right. And just see if she bite, hand your number to move, have him take it over to her. I just want to see if she texts you. Ciao, brother. All right. I want to say, text me now. Text me right now. And I want to see if she texts you right now. We're just going to test and see. Okay. Just play along. Do right. your thing from there. So you want me to come to the dinner, get her number, and tag along and play with her? Yep. Come on, man. You know I don't like to play games like that, man. I need you, bro. Come on now. You know I don't like to do that. But today <laughs> come on, I come do. Come on. It's for the greater good. I got you. You think, I, you think it'd be cool? He do gotta learn his lesson. He do. I don't like playing games with people, but sometimes people gotta learn a good lesson. That's a fact. But we ain't the ones to test people, man. That ain't our job. We're but teaching. It's teaching. He asked me to be his counselor. Okay. So all this is so this is part of his I your counselor. Okay. okay. Yeah. All right. You gotta learn on the fly, man. All right. I got you. Hey, bet. All right. All right. I gotta I gotta head to the gym, man. But okay. see, I'm doing some crazy stuff, man. Hey, thank all right. you, bro. Hey, I see you later. All right, I see you, bro. All right. What's up, Alicia? We have a situation. Kevin's team just called in. He and Lacey are on their way to an unscheduled medical what? appointment. Dwight is expecting uh, to be Kevin at Vice Lounge in two hours. All right. Uh, 
I'll fix it now. So Alicia tells me that Kevin is not showing up. Now that's a problem because Kevin created this whole scenario with Dwight Howard. Like, hey, you're gonna walk into the date, you're not gonna say anything and see if she bites. We're gonna have hidden cameras there. I mean, she knows that we're gonna be recording outside, but she doesn't know about the hidden cameras. And our job is to make sure that those hidden cameras are set. I have nothing to do with that scenario. I don't know the ins and outs like that. Like, I mean, I know Dwight, but I don't know Dwight. So I don't know, like, if Kevin's not there, Dwight may say, hey man, I trust Kevin. I don't know you guys. I don't want to do it. I got to make this happen. I have to figure this out. So I need to show up on set, make sure everything goes smoothly. Hey, my name is Jada. I like Jay because I think Jay is a very genuine guy. I think Jay is very comfortable with who he is. He's firm, strong, independent. I love that. I think Jay is very easygoing and laid back and chill. Super cool, fun guy. And I think we'd be very compatible. So I was right Dwight and Moo are en route to Vice Lounge. They're 10 minutes out. I repeat, ETA 10 minutes. Copy that. All right, team. That gives us a few minutes to let these lovebirds cozy up a bit. It for me, I think. So, you know, just moving on. I'm trying to you know, get to know someone else. Right. I would never do that to you. I so sorry you went through that. Part of the process of getting to you know people. So, yeah. so tell me more about you. Well, uh, so I work right now as a doctor, finishing up my residency. Mm -hmm. So that basically t takes up my 20%. What are you guys doing? Okay. Um, how can I help you guys today? What about you, sir? Really? Um, if I could just get a water. Right. I, I don't do any. I, I don't right. smoke. You guys are interested in anything? I want hookah, yeah. yes, hookah. Um, minty, anything minty. Minty? Yep. Minty and fruity or just minty? Doesn't matter, whatever you pick. Okay, I'll, I'll recognize something. Give me a second, I'll be right back. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. You don't smoke? No, no. Uh, I try to keep myself clean right now, uh, sober. Uh, so you said you're from where now? Uh, originally I'm from India. Okay. Uh, but I moved here when I was like four years old. Do you so. travel at all? Uh, well, I've actually, uh, like last year I got a chance to go back to visit. I mean like France, you know. Um, um, actually, I did get to go to Paris Brazil. one day for a layover, like on my way to India. Oh, London. Have you ever been to London? I have. I have. You have? It was How quite was nice. It? Gosh, I gotta go. I've never been to London before. Yeah. I do like Oh, that. I never had a guy to take me to London before. Mm, yeah. yeah. It's quite nice. Yeah. They have cute accents, you know. I bet I would love to go for a vacation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when the last time you had a relationship was that you trying to get into a relationship or was she your girlfriend? What was that? I mean, that was like that was another first date. It just didn't happen. I'm sorry. What you were saying? Uh, yeah, it just didn't happen to go my way. What you mean so much? Uh, what you uh, I'm wearing a towel. Gotcha. And you? Just a water. Just water? Oh, yeah. Ah, sure. no fun. I know, right? Make sure you get some shots. Yeah. Gotcha. I love this place. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm sorry, what were you saying? Yeah, so, uh... So, what are your thoughts on, like, family and all that? Uh, what kind of family? Or what do you see for your family? Yeah, I have a son. Um, I'm really looking for a dad for him right now. Me and my okay. my son's dad, we kind of split like a year ago, and mm -hmm. he wasn't taking care of things as he needed to. I'm someone who likes to look at myself as a kept woman. Mm -hmm. I like to, you know, kind of so have like a side, soft life, yeah. So mm -hmm. he wasn't able to do that. He wasn't able to keep that up. So we I got you. Yeah, I got you. I mean, yeah. Uh, I've heard those kind of family relations can be hard. Yeah. Um, He's incarcerated now. 
Huh? He's incarcerated now. Wow. Yeah. So. Damn. I'm sorry to hear that. I mean, for your sons, I guess. You're, you're, are you still like involved with him at all? Or? No, he's incarcerated. That's yeah, why yeah. I'm looking for my son, you know, somewhere a little bit more stable. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, I'm getting there. Do you have kids? Uh, right now, no. Do you want kids? Uh, eventually. Eventually. But, you know, um, I'm very good with kids. I enjoy spending time with them. Where is the shot? Did we not ask for a shot? Uh, it's taking him forever. I don't know. Anyways, so what are your work days? What days are you off? Uh, basically just Sundays uh, Sunday. right now. Sometimes I get the, the full So we can weekend. chill on a Sunday? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, and where are we going next? Well, I guess London now. Right? Yeah. I love London. Yeah. London. You read Harry Potter or anything like that? No, I don't read at all. Watch the movies? Uh, I think when I was like in third grade, I remember watching the movie. I can't remember much about it. Fair enough. Fair enough. What, do you like Harry Potter? I mean, I, I grew up Oh, no. Do you like reality TV? What? Do you like reality TV? I used to watch uh, Love Island a lot. As a, uh... Do you watch Love and Hip Hop at all? Huh? Love and Hip Hop. No. Oh, finally. Thank you. Thank you so Energy. much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We never got a menu. Food menu? Yes. Thank you so much. Starving. Yeah. Takes off the edge. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I kind of gave up drinking a while ago. Uh, but, you know, sometimes I kind of miss it a little bit. Oh my God. That was great. Y you look like you needed that. <laughs> yeah, I did. Yeah. Oh my goodness. You sure you don't want to? Uh, uh, it's okay. You sure? Yeah. You missing out? Okay. Yeah. So yeah, what was, um, college like for you? Did you go to college? Are you I in did, school I or did. anything? Uh, I went to UGA. Okay. Honestly, like, those are really fun four years. Yeah? Uh, yeah. You know, because, I mean, even outside... Did you play of, sports or anything? No. no, no? I, I'm, okay. I'm terrible at sports. Okay. Uh, like, I could probably sprain myself on the bench. Oh, wow. But, yeah, I mean, uh, I got to, like, meet a lot of people. Like, I got to try different things. Yeah. Uh, I was in this uh, one club, uh, I can't remember what it's called, Toastmasters, that's what it's called, where uh, you basically like get a chance to like work on your public speaking. <laughs> yeah. Right. And stuff like that. So it was like, I remember that in high school. I used to cheer in high school. Oh. Uh, I got a lot of things in high school. Yeah? Yeah, what high school did you go to? Uh, well, I went to Cambridge High School. I'm really liking a vibe in here. Yeah. It's dope. Ah, oh, thank you. Do I just two minutes out? Yes, please. Thank you. All right. Anything you like? I think I'm going to have the wings. Ooh. What else do they have other than wings? Uh, I don't know. I've not been here. Oh, before. they have wine? I never knew they had wine. I would have got wine this day. Ace of Spades champagne. Hmm. We should have went out with a game. You don't like champagne? I just said, Come I on, don't you gotta loosen up, man. You gotta I loosen know, up. I know, I know. I mean, if you ever want to do like a sparkling wine, I'm down. I'm not really into sparkling wine. Yeah, I don't know. I like it's... something to take the edge off. Mm. Don't you? Uh, well, for me, the edge is either like chocolate or like soda. So. Gotcha. I'm a fun guy. What can I say? What Party. do you do for fun? Mm -hmm. Sorry. I just been informed that we only have wings available at the moment. So, is there any particular flavor you like? 
Yeah. Can we do? Can you guys split it? Of course. I'll do hot and barbecue. Okay. That's what she said. Well, that was for me. I didn't think you wanted it. Did you want to order? Uh, I guess I'll have the same. Right. Okay. So split hot and barbecue and barbecue and hot. Yes. Hot and yeah. barbecue for me, and he can yeah. do yeah. whatever he wants. Yeah. Gotcha. Thank you. Thank you so much. I like this place. Yeah, it's got a chill vibe. Yeah, I like it. I'm gonna come back. I like this. Yeah. Wish, maybe this could be our Sunday spot. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. So, uh, when you and your husband were still together? Not husband. Oh, sorry. I, yeah. I didn't mean to assume. Never married. Gotcha. But. How long were y'all together? Maybe about... Alright, we're on go. Dwight, walk past them directly to your mark. Idea of marriage, or, and it just didn't work out because of whatever happened happened, or... Ah, looks like she took the bait, y'all. Let's work. It just didn't work out. We just kind of grew apart. Just kind of, you know, went on separate ways. So, so y'all separated before whatever happened to him, or with him, or whatever. Right? I'm sorry. So y'all separated uh, before whatever. Yeah, got, okay. it just got really bad. It just grew oh. apart. Sorry. What about you? Oh, well, I mean, I've I've had a couple long-term relationships, but through college, uh, like after college. It was a bit hard to find someone because I didn't have time for anything. Um, so yeah, uh, this girl I was with, Carly, uh, she and I were together for like junior, senior year. And I mean, we were like on and off kind of, even through that. But then once I started medical school, it just broke off. So. Yeah. How long were you in school? Uh, well, so I did undergrad in UGA, and then uh, afterwards I went to uh, Georgia Medical College. Yeah. I'm sorry, let's look at here. I thought you were familiar hey, too. That's crazy. Where I didn't see you. I just been out here working and everything, <laughs> like. Oh, my, my fault, bro. Oh, oh no, 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 no. We're just, yeah, just, yeah. We're just What's your name? Yeah. Mo. Mo. I'm, I'm Jay. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, he's my friend from school. Oh. How have you been? Have you been? I am great. I don't think we got each other contact the last time yeah, we were late. We definitely stay in contact. Let me For know. sure. Let me make sure I... You ready? Yeah. 980. Uh-huh. Ha, she uh -huh. fell for it, y'all. Wow. I heard you. I'm just gonna be, we just grabbing a little bite yeah. to eat. Yeah, sure. Ooh. So I ain't gonna be here too long. But I uh, definitely keep in contact. Nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you, man. Yeah, catch you. Yeah. Cool. It was so good running into him. Uh -huh. I haven't seen him in a while. That's good. Yeah. That's good. But you was talking about. Neither of them suspect a thing, right? Great job, Moo. Solid dressing? No. Um. I just kind of um, did my own thing after high school and, okay. you know. Did, did you have to get a license for the esthetician? Yeah, I did. Um, I got a license for it right after I graduated. Okay. Yeah. So cool. So what kind of uh, like schooling do you have to do for that? Um, just nine months. Just did nine months um, and wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. And I'm out. Nice. Yeah. Awesome. yeah. You know, these things actually start to give you a headache after a while. Oh, yeah. I can't. Crazy. Uh, I, I, I think I've done it once or twice, but yeah. I got an asthma, so it's just not really uh, good for that unless I have my inhaler right with me. So. Gotcha. Okay, guys. Let's see if she'll leave with you. Feel her out. Um, you Thank you. Some quick, right? Perfect. You done with this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, you know, I feel like, you know, as long as both people provide something to the relationship, 
uh, and it, you know it fits each other's love languages. I think, you know. Uh, thank it's good. you. Yeah. Do you have some extra sauce? Yeah, yeah, sauce. Yes, hot sauce. And uh, are my wings coming too? Sorry. Are my wings? Then you didn't order. Oh, you ordered the wings. Yeah, you did order wings, right? Yeah. Did he? It's, okay. it's cool. It's cool. Yeah, it's cool. You ordered barbecue hot. You ordered hot barbecue. I got I'm you. I'm sorry. Yeah, just it's get cool. that. Get that. Get that. Um, All right. Those look good. Yeah, they do, right? <laughs> Might have I have a celery today? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Why not? Ah, so <laughs> yeah. That sauce is good. Yeah. So like, let me ask you this. Like I've had like the the flashy guys and mm -hmm. I've had like the not so flashy. I've had the tall, short, players, you know. Like what I mean like what would make you say you can provide? Cuz my love language like I told you, I like getting getting gifts. I like flowers. I like to be showered like Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, I mean, I love giving gifts too. Uh, everything okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm I'm listening to you. I'm just going. It is right now. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I'm listening. Yeah, I mean, like, I like to think I'm the romantic type, with flowers and all that. Mm -hmm. Um, and uh, you know, I mean, I am gonna end up with a stable job so I think I can provide in that way if and when we get to that um, okay okay yeah well yeah is everything okay yeah it's just my son it's this the season where he's always so fussy at night he just misses mommy that's all but I'm listening to you, so you do think you can provide. I like that. Mm -hmm. So tell me, like, what do you do on your free time? Are you traveling? Like, what's going on? No, no. As I said, I can't travel. But, like, you know, I hang Ooh, out with... we should totally go to New Orleans for a weekend. Have you heard about New Orleans? Yeah. Like, you uh, literally sit on a strip fun. and just party all, way, all, all day. I mean, maybe I can... Okay, so Dwight, week off. tell her you're going to get ready to go. She can't be that bold. Mm. That actually would be a good second date. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Vegas. First London, then Vegas. Vegas. I'm liking Vegas. I'm liking Vegas. Okay. Mm. I have had a great time. You sure you don't want to hit this? I'm good. I'm good. All right, well. Suit yourself. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm done with this. Mm. Well, oh my I goodness. Mean, you gotta take care of your kids. Oh my goodness. Yes, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. Yes, I do have to get to my kids. What? She's leaving. She's leaving. That's wild. Uh, let's see about next week. For sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Nice to finally meet you. Yes. You want me to walk up? Oh, no, no, no. I got it, sweetie. Thank you. Okay. Wait till Kevin sees this. Can I get the bill? I like Jay because he's family oriented. He's kind. And he's just like I like my cheese steak, extra sweet. Hi, my name is Kristen. I'm 24 years old. I like Jay because he seems very understanding and sweet. 